Hey everybody, welcome back to another video of iPhone Bloke where we help quality people to pick up quality products. So in today's video presentation, I'm gonna talk about the new release iOS 14.7 beta version, which just got released, I guess, a day ago. So I wanna talk about those three wonderful features with context to you know, iPhone SE and onwards. And I truly enjoyed these two, uh, three new additions to our uh, you know, iPhone features. So uh, without wasting much of a time, let's get started. Great, so let's get started with context to iOS 14.7 beta version, so called the three new features. Now the first thing first, what iPhone 14.7 beta version has done is they have, uh, you know, uh, categorized the app library with two different options this time. And these are two different new options. And those are productivity and finance and, you know, uh, food app. Uh, library so let's go ahead and see those first so the first thing first what you have to see you have to go and check this app library where it says uh, <clears throat> productivity and finance which is this option so this is a nice touch when it comes to uh, collecting all the financial and important documents or apps at a particular place and of course I really like it because this is extremely helpful for anybody who uses both of iMobile functions and various other financial apps so that's number one Number two, if you see, this is another app called Shopping and Food. This is also a new addition, which has recently come to iOS 14.7. And again, it, it collects all your shopping food apps or other apps, which you have already on your iPhone. So that's again a smart touch. Uh, the most important uh, bit, which I personally liked in terms of uh, uh, mega changes with the help of iOS 14.7 is the addition of six different wallpapers. So for example, if you go in still, and if you check, uh, there are one, that's number one, uh, number two, number three, four, five, six. These are wonderful wallpapers which Apple has added recently, and trust me, it gives a lot of difference on your screen when you apply to it. So. Yeah, these are the three basic changes what I felt iOS 14.7 has brought to the table. And I'm sure just like me, as you all are keen iPhone users and uh, you know other stuff, this should always be a, a helping hand in case if you want to have a new look to your iPhone. Well, with this note, I want to say thanks to one and all for watching and you all have a great day. Thanks.